Hi, my name is Jim Dowling. I'm co-founder and CEO of Hopsworks, and I'm delighted to introduce for you today, Hopsworks 4.0. It's the first unified factory for building AI systems, whether they're batch applications, real-time applications, or large language model powered applications. We call it the AI lakehouse. Why do we need an AI lakehouse? Well, firstly, Python is the language of AI, but it's a second class citizen in existing lakehouses. They're designed for SQL and Spark. Secondly, performance and availability. The most challenging AI systems often need real-time data and cannot afford downtime. Thirdly, open. Whether you like Spark, SQL, Flink, Pandas, Polars, or many of the other new query engines, we have you covered. And finally, enterprise level governance. It's coming because of AI regulations. We need specialized support for it. What's new in Hopsworks 4.0? Oh, we've made real-time performance improvements, added region-level replication, improved our APIs, our user interface, and user experience. But what I'd like to highlight is the Hopsworks Feature Query Service, a new service that gives you 10 to 45 times higher throughput when reading feature data from your lakehouse or feature store. It's powered by Arrow and enables your data scientists to iterate faster, making them more productive and happier. The biggest innovation we bring you with AppSource 4.0 is support for Kubernetes type deployments. It's easier than ever before to get started building with AppSource. You can use the Kubernetes toolings and the MSARs we provide to add install AppSource. And in a matter of minutes, AppSource is up and running on any Kubernetes cluster across all cloud providers, all on prem um, for you to start using. One of the additional capabilities that we bring you with AppSource 4.0 is support for feature monitoring. This new capability allows data scientists and machine learning engineers to keep track of how the data changes over time and compare it with the data that you use to train um, a specific version of, of the model. You can get alerts um, if the data changes, if the statistic properties of the new data is different from the statistic property of the data that you've trained your model on, so that you can proactively retrain your model and make sure that the model um, is um, delivering predictions using the best data um, that, that you have access to. What about large language models? With Hopsworks 4.0, you can build and operate LLMs end-to-end, -end, creating instruction data sets and fine tuning, to model serving with VLLM on KServe, to monitoring and RAG. We added a vector index to our feature store, so now in a single feature pipeline, you can both index your documents for RAG and create instruction data sets. And what's new in RAG is that you can also query feature groups with function code. At Opsworks, we're determined to keep your data safe and always available. Both the online and offline stores, they're distributed systems designed to survive hardware and network failures. RondeMe me powers the online feature store, which is an in-memory, low-latency distributed database with several lines of availability. Due to its sophisticated replication system, it can survive even only with one node running. The offline feature store, on the other hand, it stores terabytes of training data in our very own HopsFS, which is a high-performance, POSIX-compliant, distributed file system. The metadata is stored in RONDB, while the actual file blocks, they are replicated for redundancy. Moreover, for mission-critical systems, where downtime and high recovery time is not an option, Hopsworks is the only feature store available with cross-region replication. In case of a data center outage, you can seamlessly switch to a different geographical region without any data loss. Running is the database for feature stores. Hence, we develop it in-house. You can do single feature lookups in less than a millisecond at high load. Even if you want to batch hundreds of feature key lookups, you can run your machine learning inference in 25 milliseconds. If you want to do a feature retrieval with online aggregates, you can do that in 50 milliseconds for average workloads. RondeMe is also scalable. By default, we place your values into memory. But if you want to, you can also place them onto disk. That means using modern NVMe drives, you can scale out to the biggest of feature stores at top latency. The compute layer in RondeMe also scales up and down within seconds. So you can accommodate seamlessly to any various workloads. Lastly, RondeMe supports built-in rate limits and quotas. So you can distribute your resources fairly between any team using your feature store. Hopsworks has also moved to be going beyond pure data management. It is also a tool to review your actual data for AI. You can look at the activity level, which features 
are the most used, the least used? Where is the validation? Maybe some quality issues. As a stakeholder, as a product owner, you are now able through the dashboard to actually see the actual data, the metadata, to allow everybody in your team to work better and more cohesively with an actual visibility. Not only working on databases and APIs, but having a cohesive UI that allows you to see through the data. The new Tensita Capsule functionality that is now part of the AppSearch platform has been highly requested by our customer and user community, allows you to receive notification as soon as new data is available in the AppSearch feature store for you to be able to trigger predictions and pre-computed predictions in advance. And, and when those predictions are needed, they are already available, basically eliminating latencies in your inference pipelines. OpsWorks is your one-stop shop for your ML needs. Different roles, they need different tool set. And in OpsWorks 4.0, we made it even simpler. We introduce slimmer, modular Python environments with the most common tools for your feature training and inference pipelines. Of course, you're not limited to what we're offering. You can fully customize your environment by installing your favorite Python library or any other system package. Security is often overlooked. In Hopsworth, we use state-of-the-art, in-transit and untrust encryption, and dynamic role-based access control to guard access to your most sensitive data. Resources are siloed in projects, while you can allow access to a certain group of people through your existing NDAP or OAuth identity provider. Sharing is caring, and for that reason, in Hopsworks, we have made dataset and feature sharing easy, secure, and efficient with zero copying. While you can log into Hopsworks with your organization's credentials, inside the platform, you will securely assume the project-specific role where we can apply fine-grained authorization and access control to resources. At Hopsworks, we believe that collaboration is fundamental to innovation. Our journey to revolutionize the data and AI landscape would not have been possible without the incredible support and collaboration from our numerous technology and ecosystem partners. Being an NVIDIA partner for numerous years has allowed us to leverage state-of-the-art GPUs for faster data processing and AI model training. With Open Search, we not only enhance search capabilities, making data governance more intuitive and efficient, but building a solid foundation for AI assets. OVH Cloud has emerged as a champion of sovereign cloud in Europe, and we are proud to participate in the growth of this ecosystem. And there are more. Oracle and their enterprise-grade ecosystem, Neo4j and their state-of-the-art graph databases, all those partners contribute to make us a better tool for your use cases. Technology partners matter, but the community partners also play an essential role in Hopsworks. Namfocus, organizers of the PyData community worldwide, and Ignite and AI Sweden in the Nordics have been instrumental in giving us access to business leaders and practitioners that give us the necessary feedbacks, both from a product, but also from a technological perspective. Hopsworks is also available as a serverless deployment, which essentially means that it's free to use and not limited in time for a certain sort of use cases. So if you have an MVP or maybe a student project, or you are a small startup trying to create your AI system base layer, per se, you can use serverless. That's no problem. And it will be fully functional. You will access to the same APIs, the community sort of board and forums, and you will have a great experience. Now, if you are an enterprise, we also offer you the ability to try Hopsworks for a limited time within an enterprise ecosystem. For any of those, you can either go on a website on Hopsworks Direct with serverless or contact us and we'll provide you the necessary documentation and details on how to install it on Kubernetes.